players say they're ready to play the Miami Dolphins. We'll find out Sunday at 1 o'clock. The fans, I think they're ready. We found out today at the stadium uh, just how excited they are. There was a pep rally, and Jim Stone was there. He has more. The Chargers looked at the top of their game on the practice field this afternoon as they finished final preparations for the Dolphins. A few hundred Charger fans were at the top of their games, too, for a pep rally in the stadium parking lot. They had stars in their eyes and the Super Bowl on their minds as they heard from the Charger captains. So really, we haven't done anything yet. We have to go out and win a game, or it's just like any other season that I've been through. So our goal is to go out and win and to win it all. It's been a long time since we played a lot of playoff games, too. It would be nice to win the AFC Championship here and uh, play here in the championship game and do all that stuff. Yeah. You know, it's a good feeling to see Nate right out there. He's 100% healthy, and uh, we're just going to go out there and pound him. Well, I like to say Dan, too, but Dan is, a, uh, Dan is a man. You know, he's a guy that has a great arm. He can't run a bit. So uh, I'm going to have Leslie out here running him around, you know. Uh, maybe I can get a cheap shot in there some way, somehow. Now, folks, you don't want to peak too early for a big game, but it's obvious from the turnout, the fans are ready. From what they said, the players are ready. And after all, the Chargers owe the Dolphins from two years ago. At the stadium, Jim Stone, KNSD News. So there should be some lovely people coming out of there if they don't win. Uh, before we get to that, by the way, I do want to mention that the... What, at one time... Yes, yeah, yeah, it's, it's Sunday afternoon. Uh, every sportscaster, by the obligatory standard contract, has to do predictions. I hate that. You know why? Because I'm always wrong. But I, I am doing that at 11 tonight because I think there's a, this, this seems to me either a lucky team, the Chargers, or a team of destiny, or I don't know what. But this was the uh, a playoff game, as you know, they lost to the, uh, the Dolphins after the 92 season in January of 93. And, and also, that, I mean, that's a motivating factor, even though they beat them last year when they played Miami here in a regular season game. Revenge is a large motivating factor. Then, you know, in our way of where we're trying to get to, you know, and uh, we have to beat them in order for us to uh, achieve the rest of our goal, which is to get to the Super Bowl. So, you know, other than revenge, there's other things in it, but it is a revenge factor because they embarrassed us. Yeah, we beat them last year, uh, but they didn't have Dan Marino. It wasn't a whole lot going on. Yeah, they were trying to get to the playoffs, but it wasn't like, okay, we're trying to get to the Super Bowl. This year's a very different thing. We're going to see a different team than we saw last year. You want more? Sure, sure. Uh, Steve Hendrickson was with us at the 5 p.m. news broadcast, who re reminded me of that 92 fiasco when I had been doubting the strength of this team because they played a very easy schedule, which to a certain extent they did again this year. You know that. And, and I had to apologize publicly because I didn't think they would win, but they did. I remember. Everybody in San Diego but you, huh? Because then you'd have to say, I'm sorry. <laughs> like you did in 92. Remember that? I remember. Those were the good old days, weren't they? <laughs> That's all right, because we're going to hear you say, I'm sorry. <laughs> We, you know, we're, we're, we're a better team than we were then, I think, uh, you know, at the time. And that, guy, that guy's the best right there. I think we're going to be, our, yeah, we are a better football team, I think. I think we're a more experienced team. So, see you Monday. He'll be here Monday on the 5 p.m. news broadcast and then segments on this uh, program to find out if they are better than Miami. I just don't, I'm just not impressed by Miami. Maybe it's me. I don't know. I don't know. And things happen as we discussed at 11 tonight. It's either luck or makes them seem like they're destined. Things happen so swell for them. Uh